back at WrestleCon Sav of Friday the Hannibal TV and uh, with the lovely, one of the classiest women in professional wrestling, uh, Velvet Sky. The one question I have, and I know the fans have, is where you been? Well, I have been extremely busy in my personal life. Um, oh, good. Took a little bit of a break from the ring, but I'm still involved in the wrestling industry. Right now, I am studying to be a certified personal trainer as well as I'm um, going back to school for my bachelor's degree in marketing. So I've been pretty busy, but I do always make time for the fans and the wrestling community because how can you not? I love, this is my world right here. It certainly is. I got a question for you. Uh, you were one of the original knockouts on uh, TNA. Uh, when you see how far women's wrestling has uh, become to where they're, you know, one of the headline matches at WrestleMania, how does that make you feel as sort of a pioneer? I'm very proud of those those women in wrestling right now. I mean, women's wrestling really has made strides. It's come a long way, especially from the days when, you know, back in the knockouts division when I started in 07, there really was no, um, there was no women's wrestling back then. It was just managers and, you know, stuff like that. But it has evolved so much, and I'm just so proud of all the women in TNA and WWE and Ring of Honor for just, you know, how far they've come and how hard they've worked. And we are now equal with the men, you know. This is a man's industry, but women have definitely left their mark on it and I'm very very excited to be a woman in this wrestling business so much luck to all the women out there keep going strong ladies well it was a man's industry but I think uh, with the strides that the women have made and Stephanie McMahon at the helm I think it may be a uh, men and women's industry um, right. one last question I know you're working on uh, personal stuff any chance you'll ever be in the WWE I know a lot of fans are kind of waiting for that moment that you walk through the curtain I'm telling you, that that's the number one question that I get every day, social media, in person, here at WrestleCon. That's why I asked it. I would be rich right now. I'd be able to take my money and leave WrestleCon <laughs> right now if I had a penny for everybody that's asked me that today. And I really don't have an answer for that other than never say never. Um, I, I don't. I wish I had a better answer. Um, it would be cool to experience that level, um, but never say never. That's all I can say right now. Well, good luck on your physical therapy. Thank you for taking the Thank time. Thank you. Thank you. Velvet Sky, ladies and gentlemen. Thank Thanks, you. Pat.